Hey, my name is Al and we're in Maya 2024, but regardless of what version of Maya you're in, I turn this button on every time I start modeling, whether it's a prop, a weapon, a scene. I just love having this on. And that is screen space ambient occlusion. So to find it, we're going to go to renderer. This is viewport 2.0, which is renderer. Hit the option box under viewport 2.0. Scroll down to screen space ambient occlusion. And all this is doing is it's just faking ambient occlusion, which are those contact shadows. Um, and the reason I use it is not for lighting or anything, but you can see with it off, the detail on this magazine just kind of disappears. As soon as I turn it on, things start to pop a little bit better. Now, I like to play around with the amount and radius. So I'm going to change this radius to somewhere around four or five. This is dependent upon the scale of your scene and whatnot. So play around with this value and then the amount. So the size of everything here looks really great. This is with it off and then on. And it allows me to come in here and just differentiate different pieces of my model instead of just the gray just blending in. Things pop a little bit better. I can see what's going on and it just helps in the modeling process. 